Greetings to you. My name is the Reverend Kathy McCallum, and I'm the Retired Associate Minister at Trinity United Church. When I was a child, my mother used to sing a song to me when we walked in the rain, and the other day I found myself singing it in my garden. Down came the raindrops on a rainy day, wetting all the sidewalks, washing dirt away, waking little buds and thirsty seeds as well, right into the blades of grass, the tiny raindrops fell. It had been a really dry spell for a while, and everything in the garden was wilting before my eyes. The garden needed rain, and it needed it very badly. And so when the rain finally came, everything rejoiced, the garden and me with my silly song. The next morning, it looked like a new world in my garden. The plants were standing up smartly. Everything was fresh and green and clean and beautiful. The Bible talks a lot about water. Psalm 147 encourages us to sing to the Lord with thanksgiving. For God covers the heavens with clouds, prepares rain for the earth, and makes grass grow on the hills. The Gospel of John refers to Jesus as giving us living water that springs forth into eternal life. And of course, the story of Noah and the ark reminds us that after the rain comes the rainbow. Like the garden, we too go through spells in our lives when life feels dry and arid. And we're still living with COVID and sometimes we find it hard to find meaning in our lives. We're bored, we're restless, we're fearful. We miss the close contact of family and friends. Sometimes we need to, we long to feel that gentle rain falling from above into our hearts to be reminded that God cares for us, we who are part of this amazing world that God created and God loves. So we sing our silly songs, or our hymns, or we pray, or we chat with a friend. We look out at the beautiful flowers, and we feel the raindrops of God's love and mercy in our hearts. Or we heed Jesus' words that we are to offer a cup of cold water to those in need. And in calling someone, in reaching out, we find that we too are bathed in the healing waters of God's love for us, God's beloved children. May God's Spirit bless you and grace you with that welcome and needed rain of comfort, the reminder that after the rainbow comes the rain, that we are always, always held in God's loving and gracious hands. Amen.